One of the most common questions in the LEGO gaming community is what would make for a great LEGO game? And a lot of people will immediately go on ahead and jump to the obvious choices, whether it be Marvel, DC Comics, Harry Potter, and obviously those have all made for great LEGO games before, and so people double down on the idea that they could make some more. And I don't disagree with that. Then there's some other ones that are absolute no-brainers as well, like, for example, the TMNT franchise or Transformers. I think those would be cool too. But I was scrolling through Instagram and I found this account by the name of Therantha. I hope I'm saying that correctly. Hey, I'll have the Insta link down in the comments below. But my goodness, this set off a light bulb and I was like, this franchise would work perfectly as a Lego title. What am I talking about? Well, I'm of course bringing up Ben 10. Now, if you don't know, Lego and Ben 10 are not unfamiliar. There have been kind of Bionicle style or almost like mech style figurines before for Ben 10, which I think are kind of made. I really don't know why they didn't go the minifigure route with Bruh. those. I think that would have been something that could have really been quite popular. But the point being wow. is that this absolute genius artist went ahead and rendered a bunch of terrific designs from the different iterations of Ben 10. Now, I am most familiar with kind of like the original, original lineup. So, you know, the characters like Forearms, for example, looking incredible as a giant big fig. Characters like Wild Mutt or Gray Matter looking incredible with the shorter leg design. I think that this is a no brainer. One of the things that I think is absolutely necessary for a successful Lego game is a world that is very, very big and in addition to that, lots and lots of different characters that are present within that world. And guess what? Ben 10 kind of checks off those two right off the bat because you could go on ahead and potentially see a Lego title where you're able to go on ahead and collect a ton of these different aliens. They could tackle whether it be the original Ben 10, Ultimate Ben 10, or any other iteration and bring in all those aliens, all those villains into the game making for an absolutely terrific experience. I think that as far as the character roster is concerned, there really would not be any problems. I also think you could make for really great hub world with the big giant city. You could have the campsite outside the city, similar to the Band 10 video games. And so from that aspect, I think that it would do very well. Plus, I think the Ben 10 is getting into that category of being something that is classic enough to where there's a lot of people that would love to go back to relive their childhoods through a lego ben 10 game but it's still modern enough to where there would still be a lot of newer fans as well and so i guess the question now comes down to you let me know what you guys think of the idea of a ben 10 lego game do you think that it would be as good as i think it could turn out to be i think it's one of those franchises that is kind of misutilized i really don't think that it's being positioned for the best possible success that it could have and a lego franchise for this particular ip would be massive i mean just the video game would be huge and i think would do really 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 well but beyond the video game i think that some real lego sets would be very well received also let me know if you guys agree disagree down in the comment section below and if you do disagree let me know what other franchise you would like to see instead